It's time now for your local first alert forecast. I'm meteorologist Pierce Legion. As we head through your day today, storm system passes by off toward our south, and uh, it's going to give us a mixture of uh, pretty much all types of precipitation here across the mountain state. I think through the morning hours, at least early on, we'll see a mixture of snow, sleet, freezing rain, even some rain, depending on where you are location-wise. But we'll all see a change over to snow as the system passes us by later on this morning. However, by then, the deepest uh, moisture will be working its way off toward the east. So we'll expect mainly light snow from late morning into the early afternoon hours before things start to taper off later on this afternoon. Could even end the day with a couple of breaks for some sunshine. But uh, with the uh, snow, sleet, and freezing rain out there, uh, overall, snowfall amounts should be a lot lower than we were initially thinking. Most places are just a couple of inches, but uh, areas close to the Ohio River should get hit pretty hard by the storm as those are the most likely areas to stay all snow as we head through your day today. So again, wintry mix changing to some light snow by later on this morning. Then we'll see a taper off by a little bit later on this afternoon. Highs today uh, will be this morning. First thing, 34 for Fairmont and Clarksburg. We'll see 33 today for Morgantown 100 along with Kingwood and Davis. 34 this afternoon in Elkins, 33 in McKinnon. We'll see 35 in Weston and Glenville for later on today. Hometown forecast, six is out to Wetzel County, Jacksonburg. Hello to you. Expecting things to stay all snow there for you. Snow should start to taper off this afternoon, and uh, you'll have several inches of accumulation by the time all is said and done for sure. High for you this morning, 33. Temperatures kind of hold steady in the lower 30s for the rest of your day today. Tonight will all dry out, partly to most of the cloudy skies expected. Going to be a cold night. We'll see some cold rear filtering in behind this storm system, certainly. 19 tonight for Clarksburg and Fairmont. 20 for Morgantown, Harrisville and Weston. 17 out in Kingwood. And we'll see 14 tonight over in Elkins. 42 for your day tomorrow. Starting off with some sunshine, but clouds do start to fill back in. And We'll see uh, rain for the lowlands coming in late in the day, a mixture of snow, sleet, and freezing rain in the mountains. And we'll see that uh, mixture change over to all rain, even in the mountains, overnight uh, through Tuesday night. into your day on Wednesday. Rain can be heavy at times right through Wednesday morning. So we'll have to keep on, uh, an eye on area streams, creeks, and rivers for some flooding concerns. Could also have some ice jams that could cause some additional flooding as well. So a lot to keep an eye on for you late Tuesday into Wednesday. We certainly will. Looks like we turn colder again Wednesday afternoon with rain changing to, again, some light snow. We'll see temperatures fall back close to 30 by Wednesday evening. Pretty quiet for Thursday and Friday with some sunshine. Temperatures are rebounding close to freezing by Friday afternoon. Looks like some rain and snow showers on the way for your Saturday. Sunday, still a bit of a question mark. Could have all snow or we could see rain changing over to snow Sunday afternoon. So we'll have to continue to fine tune that forecast for you. 35 looks like Saturday and Sunday. Snow showers and a little bit colder as we head toward next Monday. Of course, remember, you can always get your first alert forecast online anytime at WDTV.com.